The Master Ball is finally coming back to Pokemon Go, and this time, <laughs> it's for free. Which is great for me, because I've already used both of mine. I'll be raiding, completing field research, and grinding wild spawns until I find my first shiny. Then BAM! Master Ball time. Even if it's a Pokemon that sucks. And I'll be possibly a better one to grind. No. Master Ball? Letting it fly, there it is. The Master Ball's away. This is the one Pokemon we could use on it, and honestly, it looks pretty good in the galactic scene. And there it is, Jinx. Shiny Jinx caught in my first ever Master Ball. That is so cool. Okay, a 1054 CP, Santa Monica, California, caught in the Master Ball. <laughs> this is insane, bro. And the IVs? Oh no, dude. Oh, that sucks. On May 22nd, 2023, the Master Ball was released in Pokemon Go. And after 235 days, three countries, and hundreds of daily incense attempts, I finally used it. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. It finally happened. Bam! <gasps> Articuno, we're using the Master Ball, my last Master Ball. We're gonna launch it, and there it is, my first ever second ever Master Ball throw goes to Galarian Articuno, the one and only. This is awesome. And we finally get this Pokemon after months of searching for it. This has been one of the roughest hunts I have ever done. But 1338 CP in a Master Ball, terrible IVs. We also have the details for the upcoming Flock Together event day happening on May 11th from 2 to 5 p.m. local time. In the wild, we'll have Pidgey, Murkrow, Wingle, Starly, Pidove, and Fletchling. So a bunch of flying type Pokemon, all of which can be shiny. Fun hunts. Nothing super meta relevant in here though in the spawns other than Murkrow, which has a shadow and Shadow Honchkrow is actually a pretty good dark type. And by spinning Pokestops and completing field research, you can get Pokemon like Spearow, Doduo, Hootoot, Halo and Rufflet, with Rufflet being a pretty cool encounter. Again, nothing here has uh, super meta relevant relevancy, but they all will have higher shiny rates in the field research because this is technically, I think, a research day event. This is, right? Yeah, flock together research day. Yes, so higher shiny rates in the field research. And as we always talk about, the research day events are always like, Pretty much the best days to play for Shundo hunting in Pokemon Go, especially for free, because you don't have to hatch eggs, you don't have to pay for uh, raid passes, you just do field research, which is usually super duper easy, you get encounters, and they have higher shiny rates, and the nice thing with the field research is the IV floor is 10-10-10 which means you have a much higher chance of getting a Shundo from field research than you do in the wild. So always a great day to hunt, always a great day to try to get yourself a Shundo. And it's cool because we have five different Pokemon coming out of the field research instead of the usual like one single Pokemon. So even though the Pokemon aren't really meta relevant, it's still a really great day to hunt. So, and there's also gonna be a $1 uh, paid time to research that will allow you to basically get more encounters of one single Pokemon of these five from the research. So if you want to get more Rufflet encounters, you can pay a dollar and you get more Rufflet encounters or Taylo or Hoot Hoot, which is kind of cool actually. Like that's like, yeah, it's not the worst thing ever. Again, I'm not the biggest paid time research guy, but like if you want more encounters of a specific Pokemon, I'm assuming also with the higher shiny rates, you can pay a dollar for that. How many encounters? No idea, but that's cool, I guess. Then my friends, get ready because the Master Ball is returning, which is happening Tuesday, May 14th at 10 a.m. to Sunday, May 19th at 8 p.m. local time. And uh, we'll be getting bonuses, which include 10 times XP rewarded for the first catch of the day, 10 times XP awarded for the first Pokestop or gym spin of the day, and five times Stardust on the first catch of the day, which is really awesome. And then during this time window, the new special research storyline, the Masterwork Research Catching Wonders will be available, and the rewards will be Stardust, Berries, Pokemon Encounters, and the one and only Master Ball. It does look like this will be a pretty difficult research to complete that might take days, weeks, months, depending on how hard and diligent you play. For me, probably on the weeks to months range. So just keep that in mind here that this research is not meant to be completed super quickly, and there will probably gonna be like some annoying research tasks like catch a Pokemon 5,000 days in a row that will require you to log on and play every single day. Like for example, this was the last page of the special research for last year's Master Ball special research. 
catch 150 Pokemon and Pokeballs, catch 150 in Great Balls, catch 150 in Ultra Balls, and then catch 150 different species of Pokemon, with that last one kind of taking a long time because typically there's only a couple species spawning at once during events. So not easy to do, but obviously the Master Ball is worth it. And important to note that this is a free research that never expires. Typically in the past, I think, didn't we have to pay for the Master Ball, right? It was like five bucks to get the research or something. Maybe the first one was free. I don't know. Either way, this is a free research. And again, once you claim it, you can complete it whenever you want. But I'm pretty sure this is one of those researches where like you need to log in within the event window in order to get the research for free. Uh, so make sure you log in. Again, the dates for this uh, will be May 14th through May 19th. Make sure you log in, set a calendar reminder and get your free Master Ball. Well, the research storyline that eventually will give you a free Master Ball because it's definitely worth it. Oh, and there's also gonna be field research uh, during this event as well that will give you Stardust, XP and balls. So if you want to get some extra stuff, uh, this will give it to you. And that's kind of what's going down for the Master Ball and the Flock Together research. A little bit of a quick update today, but exciting for the Master Ball. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you're ready. Check out these other two videos on screen. Click them. Click them. Click them.